it's Katie. So today I'm going to review some wigs that I've bought. So um, I ordered these from a shop whose name I'm not entirely sure how to pronounce. Bright Lele, Bright Lala or something, I don't know, but I ordered them from there. I ordered them using Tenshi Shop and they arrived well, they arrived in the UK really quickly, but unfortunately Parcel Force is fucking useless, so yeah, they take a while to get to me. But I've got them now, so I've opened them and I've taken them out of the cardboard box. And I've also had to look at them and I'm just like storing them in the little bags they came in. But I thought maybe I might as well just review them. So... This is the first one. They come packaged in these little boxes and they also have a plastic bag and a net and they come with a free wig cap. That's always useful. Uh, I've got to try and get this out now. <laughs> yeah, so this is the first one. I will write down in the description the links to the wigs and what colours they are. But there we go. So... This is really nice, you might not be able to tell, but it's actually really, really soft and very long, but I was kind of expecting it to be. And I know it, I think looking at my camera at the moment, it looks quite shiny, but in real life, it's not as shiny as it looks on the camera. It's like more natural looking. So, yeah, so it's a really good length. It's got these little curls here at the bottom. And I think this will probably be quite easy to style if I ever had to. So there is the first one. It's this really nice light brown colour, like a really natural looking brown. And it's just like generally really nice. And the next one I've got here. And... Yep, that also came with a free wig cap. We'll just take the net off this. I really love this one because it's kind of purpley. And I don't know, what I like about it is it starts off darker at the top. So I don't know, I think that kind of makes it look a bit more natural, like, like you've got roots coming through or something. But yeah, so this, again, because of the way the light is in here and because of the way my like phone camera his camera phone, whatever. It looks more shiny and fake on the screen, but in real life it looks really, really nice. And it's sort of like a light brownie blonde, but it's got bits of purple going through it. Um, I forgot to mention about that one. The top of this one is just like that, so like on my bodyline wigs. But the top of this one is i don't know i don't know if you can see there but the top of this one is a bit more real looking it's like got an actual parting in it so i think that's quite good because it probably makes it look a bit more like not like a wig when you actually wear it but at the moment i'm not entirely sure which of these is my favorite i think i'm gonna have to like buy more of these because they're really nice and all my current wigs are from bodyline which are also nice but it's been a while, I've had most of them for a few years, and they're just, they kind of like, there's only so much washing and styling and stuff that I can do, and they're kind of beyond being fixed at this point, so these are my new ones. So just give me a second, and I will try my wigs on. Right, so this one here is the purpley one, and first of all I'd say that the, um, size for this one is definitely a lot smaller than the bodyline ones which is a good thing because the bodyline ones are actually slightly too big for my head but this one seems to fit all right um i'll have to trim the fringe a little bit but i'll do that some other time and i don't know i really like this one i really like the color of this and it's not quite as thick as the bodyline ones, but I think that works quite well because I think when it's too thick it looks like a bit too unnatural, but I think this one looks alright. There we go. 
Yeah, that's how thick it all is together. Yeah, so I think it's a good length. It's about there-ish. Just put the put that back. Yeah, so I really like this one, so now I'm gonna go try on the other one. And this is the round one. So again, the wig is definitely smaller than the bodyline ones, and I think it's a bit thinner, but I think that kind of works. At least it works for me, because, like, the other ones look really fake on me. So, um, yeah, again, I'm definitely going to have to trim the fringe on this, but I think that's, like, normal for wigs, because whenever I've got wigs before, I've always had to trim the fringe on them. And, yeah, this one is so long, it's amazing. It's like, I don't even know if you can see, it's there, it's down there, it's just really long and it's really really nice and really soft and I actually can't tell which wig is my favourite one um don't know maybe they're both my favourite and I'll just have to buy some more and then decide which of those is my favourite but yeah so that is just a quick review of these wigs okay bye